The EURCAP facility aims at building government's capacities in return and readmission management. It is jointly designed and implemented by the Directorate General for Home Affairs of the European Commission and IOM, the International Organization for Migration. So far, the European Union has signed 18 readmission agreements, a number of return arrangements and standard operating procedures. However, arrangements between both parties are not enough to ensure that efficient processes are in place. Countries of origin of irregular migrants, but also countries of transit, request technical cooperation support to manage returns and the readmission process efficiently and accountably. In order to digitalize the readmission process, the AirCAP facility has developed a number of e-platforms that allow state authorities to upload readmission applications and biometric data in a secure and GDPR compliant way. These e-platforms are readmission case management systems. The RCMS is giving us the possibility to print out this emergency travel document. If we needed to, the person can uh, travel tomorrow instead, waiting two or three weeks for the courier to, uh, to return from Sri Lanka with this emergency travel document. Especially in cases of national security, I think the RCMS will be a, a very efficient way and a very practical way for us also to prioritize this kind of, of, of special cases. This new uh, system will be more user-friendly and the uh, entire process will be managed uh, online. After that, uh, the whole process, readmission process, from issuing travel document to enter into the country, uh, will be recorded in our system. The person doesn't need to wait for a very long time in a, in a period of time of, of well, insecureness, so he can return safely and soon as possible to his family and friends.